Hey everyone, it's the Poverty Princess here with my newest creation, part one of two. This is my Glam Dessert Display Stand. It is three, la uh, three levels, three layers, and as glam and fancy as it looks, it is really not that hard to make. Would you believe me if I said you only need candle holders and plates? For this DIY, you're going to need three plates in different sizes. Um, you can use round or square. I chose round. And I started the bottom with a largest size plate that I could find from Dollar Tree. And I also used a little smaller one, um, more like a medium. And this one is maybe about an eighth of an inch smaller than this one. Um, I was questioning maybe I should have went with something a little smaller, like a saucer. But then that would have been too small. So I'm, I'm not second guessing. I'm happy with this. You will also need four of the glass candle holders from Dollar Tree, E6000, uh, spray paint of your choosing. I chose to go with a uh, felspar, more like a flat gold. I'm almost out of my rose gold, so I went with that instead. And it's actually very, very easy to do this DIY. Um, you'll also need paper doilies from Dollar Tree, and I will tell you why in one moment. Essentially, you are taking the candle holders and flipping one upside down on top of the other, cementing it together with E6000, and then when it's pretty, um, uh, pretty dry, you will center it on the plate. This is your first level. Then you will attach the second plate to the top of this candle holder using E6000. And then with the second set of candle holders, you do the same thing as you did with the first. You flip one on top, cement them together with E6000, let them dry, you center that also on this plate, and then you glue the very last plate on top of this. Again, all with the 6000 and uh, a quick dash of hot glue to hold it in place while it's drying. Definitely let this dry for 24 hours, because when you're using these um, the ceramic plates, um, you want this to all hold and be secure. If you're not using a good glue, and if you don't wait for it to completely dry, it could very easily topple over and <laughs> smash and maybe even hurt yourself. Uh, so definitely let it dry for 24 hours. I used two coats of paint. Um, last coat actually was underneath. I didn't worry about the bottom one here, but you definitely do want to have the sides done um, so that it is all pretty even looking as far as the, the color. Now I also used some adhesive diamond wrap um, from Dollar Tree. I decided to go with this really pretty sort of like a citrine color. I thought it would actually look nice and I'm actually glad I did. So I decided to really glam this baby out um, using E6000 to apply it up here. I left this one um, bare, but I did put some around the very base where there is a little bit of glue you might see. And it hides the glue, glam it up. Um, I put a double strip here where the candle holders are joined together. Uh, also did that with the very first plate, again, where the candle holder is cemented to the plate. And then, of course, where the candle holders are joined together. Now, when everything is completely, completely dry, um, you definitely want to use 
paper uh, lace doilies on this if you are going to display um, any edibles on here like cupcakes, um, cookies, I made truffles so I'm going to have them in the tiny little um, mini cupcake uh, the little paper cups I'm going to have them all placed around um, once things like this are painted these are no longer food safe so you do not want any edibles to come in contact with the paint so the safest and prettiest way to go about doing this is to simply uh, put some paper lace doilies on top and then use baking cups to um, display your edibles, your cookies, and any sort of munchies that you've made for the holidays. Um, I am so pleased with the way this turned out, and as I said, this is part one of two. I am also working on a clam cake stand and a pie stand, which I am definitely trying to get done by at least the 19th, just in time for the holidays, so everything looks nice, nice here Christmas Day. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video. As always, thank you so much for watching. Um, if you like this video, please hit the subscribe button, and have yourself a happy holidays, folks. I will see you soon. Good night.